great musical instruments in the world. Um, it was built in 1954, just after the hall opened, and is the organ on which I recorded All Night Chroma. The All Night element uh, refers to uh, it's quite an epic experience of beginning recording at about 10 p.m. and going right through till 7 in the morning which was uh, pretty memorable for everyone and I think testament to James's commitment and uh, tenacity it's extremely demanding I remember thinking I don't know how on earth he's putting this off but he did the evidence is there in the 17th and 18th centuries to name uh, the pieces of music after the stop combinations. So I decided to do that with this music. So the title of, for instance, the first piece is Voix Celeste. Um, that denotes a particular stop registration, uh, but also kind of conjures the essence of the atmosphere of the music as well. typical sound of the organ is one of the things I love about it, the force and the power that you get when you pull all the stops out, quite literally. Still, there are these otherworldly corners to the organ. That's the first thing I wanted to explore, uh, in particular on the, uh, the monochroma pieces, um, focusing primarily on the flute voices, and these for me they do have an ethereal and quite sweet character. Here we are at the Royal Festival Hall Organ Console. Um, you can see four keyboards and there's also a keyboard for the feet where generally speaking the bass end of the music comes from. Um, on the side here we have a vast array of stops. Each stop is um, an individual sound colour. So part of the joy and the um, excitement of being an organist is that you can uh, register the music just as a painter would uh, paint and mix colours on a colour palette. You can mix and match your sounds to your desired musical effect. Another great thing about the organ is that the building is as much a part of the instrument as the instrument itself. So these bass frequencies really can make the building shake. So I'll just play you a little bit of the low end of this instrument. of presetting your registrations and recalling them so as if by magic the stops come out and go in again you set up your uh, registration scheme in chronological order with these preset buttons here so in the score I've written in uh, for this particular instrument that at a certain place I'll advance on to the third combination and then advance on to the fourth combination later in the piece and so on and so forth.